Hello, everybody. <laughs> Laughter's good. Definitely. Gotta laugh. Laughter is a great thing. Um, the reason I'm laughing is because I'm reading this article. And the Fed equals end our, <laughs> end our country. This is good stuff here. I'm going to link this up so you guys can check it out. Those of you who like to read, I don't know, it's a couple pages. It's good stuff, though. You know, my favorite part of it is uh, probably about halfway through. It says, um, oh, man, I lost it. It's on a site, Let's Get Real, A Gay Girl's View of the World, which doesn't have anything to do with reason I'm posting it. It's just, I like to look for views that are opposite mine. Just, you know, just to kind of put things in perspective. I don't like just looking at information that I believe in. You know, that supports my ideas and what I've learned in my um, truth seeking. But, please, could anyone help me out here? Where do you learn this stuff? This is here, I'll, I'll read, I can't find the part I wanted to read, I'll read you this. The very last two sentences. Protecting the independence of the Federal Reserve is essential to our freedom. <laughs> ending it would enslave us. So ending the Fed would enslave us. <laughs> okay, but I want to show you this one important part here. And then I want to tell you one other last tidbit of news. That I, that I saw today. Um, just a second. Okay, here it is. In fact, the current value of gold is being driven by factors other than actual availability. It's being driven by a perception that it is more safe than money. A, per a perception being created by those who will profit from building that perception. People like Ron Paul, whose personal wealth is allegedly in gold. And Glenn Beck, who's paid very nicely in real money <laughs> to build up the idea that the end of the world is coming and we all need to have gold to barter with. Worse, the perception is causing people to turn in their gold or purchase items which are not really gold. The market's being driven by fraud. I mean, where do you come up with this type of stuff? Okay, so on the back of that, um, you know, how paper's real money and gold's just some shiny metal that man gives value to. Um, I'd like to say on my blog I posted, um, which there's a link on my homepage of my channel, Turkey adds 63 tons of gold due to acceptance of metal as reserve requirement from banks. So we got central banks adding tons of gold, but I guess no one notified the person writing that end our Fed's going to ruin our country. So anyway, I, I guess some of you guys maybe you like to watch the videos. You don't care to read so much, but anyone who likes to read, I will link up this article. To me, it's just, I don't know. I like reading this stuff. I don't know where people come up with this. How, how do you, where do you learn this type of stuff? It doesn't make it. There's no common sense. It doesn't make any sense. We lose our freedoms if we lose the Fed. 